MRI result Monday for the 49ers. A series of players underwent the, the big test today at Stanford Hospital and the results are trickling in. Nothing yet for Brock Purdy or Debo Samuel, but some results have come in and I'll go ahead and keep you updated in as timely of a fashion as possible. So the, the results that we have are Dante Johnson, veteran cornerback, ACL tear, very, very unfortunate for Dante Johnson, who's been such a big part of this football team, persevered through so much, over 30 transactions, signings, and cuts from the 49ers over the years. Uh, and, and he stepped up in that divisional playoff game against Green Bay. Devontae Adams and Aaron Rodgers last year started at cornerback in an epic 49ers win. So Dante, at age 31, you got to wonder if this, this threatens his career here, right? Because... Um, <sighs> I mean, he, he's, he's found a way to survive on the roster for some time now, but it's going to be tough to overcome this ACL tear. And the other piece of news that we have so far is from Matt Barrows, who reports that Kevin Givens likely has suffered an MCL strain or MCL sprain, I, I should say. And Givens, uh, that just is going to depend on the timetable to return how severe of a sprain it is. Elijah Mitchell has suffered two MCL sprains so far this year. Both have had eight-week recovery timetables. He's still coming back from the second one, expected back from the playoffs. Aziz Alshire, though, came back after like six weeks. He came back sooner. And that's going to be a huge you know, determinant here in whether or not the 49ers see Kevin Givens return this season. Because if it's eight weeks, probably done. Super Bowl's about eight weeks away. But if it's on the shorter end, if it's from four to six, then Kevin Givens may be back. But the 49ers are still going to have to be very creative about how they allocate the, uh, their IR spots because they only have two IR returns left. So this is going to be a game of Tetris that they play. Remember that Hassan Ridgeway, uh, another defensive tackle, is also currently hurt for the 49ers and not expected back until around the playoffs. So uh, the 49ers may have to decide between Givens and Ridgeway. It's going to be really interesting to see how they manage this with all the injury returns.